Hello guys, it's Kelly. Welcome to reading your comments. Um, I have my AC on in the background, so you'll probably hear that. Uh, we just put out air conditioners in yesterday, so yeah. I um, also want to say to you before we get started, guys, days I don't upload, I mean, I've, I've been uploading the last couple days now. So, but, you know, days when I don't upload, I encourage you to go back and watch some of my old videos. Because I have so many, I have so many different playlists too, I encourage you guys to give them a chance, you know. Because I'm sure a lot of you guys haven't seen all my videos, so... It would just help me out and just, you know, like I said, give you something to watch on days I don't upload. I encourage it. I do that a lot. Pretty much all the time, so. Anyways, um, let's get started. Dylan Vincent. Hi, Kelly. I'm sorry I was commenting too much on your channel. I watch your video. I need to stop doing that. You right. I need to stop. This is gonna, going to control you. Are you right. I'm sorry, Kelly. I'm going to stop doing that. I saw you. promise. And then I replied, it's okay. Because then I get it. You know, you're a fan. Yeah. A fan, and you just, you know, like commenting. Um, Dylan Vincent, hey, Cal, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for being my friend. Thank you so much. Keep making videos. I'm proud of you. Thank you for your support. Debbie Young, put thanks again, Casey. No problem. Dylan Vincent, well, Kelly, good job on your video. I love you. Good job. I love you, Kelly. I love you. A right, good YouTuber. And then people have a bunch of heart emojis. Again, thank you for your support. Love you, Kelly. You are so beautiful. I love you. Keep making videos. I love you. Bye. I love you with emojis. Thank you. Glory Glan, you're probably his number one fan, meaning Jesse's. Probably am. Glory Glan, Dylan seemed like a nice friend. Thanks for being kind to my sister, Dylan. Mm -hmm. He is nice. Glory Glan, pick me. <laughs> LOL. She didn't put LOL. I said LOL. And then she just put hair LOL. <laughs> Jim Greenstein, he put bro, and then I replied to him, hey, I haven't seen you in the comments in a while. And he hasn't really commented since, but I do reply, guys, um, to comments sometimes, but I mainly just reply to them through these videos. So, yeah, I just want to put it Sometimes I do reply to pending, but most of the time, yeah. Dylan Vincent, hey, Kelly, I got a knock-knock knock joke for you. Knock-knock. Okay, who's there? Dylan Vincent. I'm crying, and then I put, what's wrong? He put, I hate my life, my life sucks, I'm sick, I'm having a stomach bug, I hate my life, why do I have to get sick for eating too much food? Um, then he put, I can't even control my digestive system, I need too much food, that's why I hate my life, I hate my life, and I'm still crying. And then he put, I hate my life with the crying emojis. I can have a little bit of digestive issues, but mine, I think it's because I lay around too much. It's like sometimes, you know, it just... Now, I don't know if I would call an issue, but sometimes I just have trouble with gas. But anyways, um, that sucks, sucks to be sick, you know, not fun, but you know, this time of year it does happen and allergies and stuff, so it's not fun. Dylan Vincent, I got good news and bad news. And I put what? He put, I got a new Bluetooth speaker. Then he put, I got a new Bluetooth speaker, it's black, it's a JBL Bluetooth speaker. I don't know what that means. I'm assuming maybe it's like the brand. Cool. Dylan Vincent, am I a bad friend or am I a good friend to you, Kelly? Am I a bad friend or am I a good friend? I put good. And he put, thank you, Kelly. Take care. Bye. And then he put bye. Dylan Vincent, do you want to be friends with me? Yes or no. Do you want to be friends with me? Yes or no. Do you want to? And then Colin put, please stop spamming her. And then he put, he put Colin, why are you being so mean? I don't think, Colin was not really mean for saying that. Um, and I've said this for all my randomers, all my subscribers, who I call randomers for those of you who didn't know. You guys are all my friends. Dylan Vincent, I hate my mom. I don't love her. No more, Kelly. I hate her. My mom is crazy. I hate her so much. I feel like I'm going to tell her I don't love her no more. I hate my mom so much. Goodbye. You know what? I don't get when I first saw this comment. If you guys remember last, um, reading your comments, here's the video now. Dylan Vincent, hey Kelly, my mom died with cancer. She died. I lost her. She died with cancer. He said his mom died of cancer. But now he's saying about how he wants to tell he don't love her. Um, so I don't know why you lie about that, Dylan. It's pretty messed up to lie about something like that. Like that April's Fool's joke you did. But yeah, I'm not trying to be mean to you or call you out. But so it's a little mean. And look, I get it. We all get like that with our parents where we may not like them in the moment when they did something we don't like but you know she's still your mom at the end of the day and you love her dylan vincent hey kelly i got a new iphone 13 i got a new iphone 13 it's blue i got a new one are you happy for me i got a new one are you happy 
Yeah, it's good. I got an iPhone too. Congrats. Blue is a nice color. Um, Shadow Wolf Blackout on Storyfire for High Beautiful. Hey, and thanks for the compliment. Um, they call me Joggy Ghost. Hashtag AGP. Happy to see you back and making videos. Me too. I love making videos so much. Kalem Costick, you already know I'm going to support you, Kelly. Appreciate that. Kalem Costick, you're a good girl. Thank you. Appreciate that. You know, making videos is something I really enjoy doing, you know. I'm excited to get into vlogging now. You know, I made the vlog on Friday. I mean, it came out on um, yesterday, but I'm so happy to get into vlog. And I hope you guys are excited for more vlogs. Dylan Vincent, hey Kelly, can I ask you a question? I need to tell you something. There's something I need to tell you about. Can I ask you a question, please? Can I, please, Kelly, can I ask you something, please? And I reply, you don't have to ask me. You can just ask me something. Um, and that's true, guys. If you want to tell me something, ask me a question, you could just say, you don't have to ask permission to ask a question. Um, Dylan Vincent, Kelly, my little brother, Caden, he's sick today. He's at home all by herself, and my uncle lost his ex-girlfriend, Kathy let her in and he took his watches and his old phone. I'm getting worried. My uncle was needs to break up with his ex-girlfriend. What happened today? Well, but it sounded very, you used calling her the ex-girlfriend, so that usually means they're already broken up and saw that happen to your uncle and saw your brother sick. I hope he's doing better. Dylan Finchin just put the sad emojis. Dylan Finchin, hey, Kelly, how are you doing? How's your day doing? I was just relaxed in my bed, but how's your day doing? How's your day doing, Kelly? Pretty good. I'm good. Dylan Vincent, hey Kelly, good job making your videos. I'm proud of you. Good job. Keep doing it again. Oh, I am proud of you. I hope you get well. You're my best friend. Love you. Bye. Um, but thank you. Go like on, but take a test. You don't give it to other people. Mr. XD Game ZZYT, put Kelly, take a test. Um, I did before to when I said I might have had COVID. I don't know. I can't be 100% sure, sure I didn't, but I'm pretty sure I didn't have it. Because that night I was able to taste it um, again. You know, I think I just had a cold. But, you know, the thing is, too, with the test, I was already a couple days into being sick. Like, two or three days in. So, it's like, if I have it, yes, you want to give it to other people. I love my pants. So, if I have it, there's a good chance they would get it regardless, even if they get tested. You know, that's the thing with taking a COVID test. Like, it, all the test does is confirms if you have it or not it doesn't like that's all it does so it's really that huge of a thing if you have it you have it there's nothing you can do about it yes you know it can tell you you don't have to go around people but so i need a drink guys but you know i mean i'm not saying that to be an actual you know and every time too you get sick you don't have to take a test you know what i mean like if you guys feel comfortable every time you don't feel well taking tests, then take the test. I'm not anti-testing or anything. I'm just saying that's just my personal opinion on it. Tell them, Fitz and hey, Kelly, I'm so sorry you have COVID. I hope you will feel better soon. I feel bad for you. I hope you'll feel better soon. Hey, get past you. Okay, I wish you the best. I love you so much. You like your best friend to me, and you are my best friend. I will always be your best friend. I'm happy for you. Hope you feel better. Yeah, I'm... I'm I'm better. I'm pretty good. I'm happy to be not sick anymore. Um, Dylan Fence and Kelly, I've always been worried about you. Are you okay? Are you fine? I've always been worried about you. Been worried sick. Are you okay? Please tell me if you're okay. I'm worried about you. Are my best friend? Are you okay? I put I'm fine. You put I'm so happy. You're okay, Kelly. I'm so happy. You're okay. Thank you. Um, Tun Tunka Tunka. I don't know how you say that. Gamer. For my family is bigger than yours. Hey, and like what was the point of you saying that i'm trying to grow my following how big is your following dude um you know like okay i'm trying to grow it's not easy to grow i try my best to you know i've been doing way better and better with videos editing rise and video wise i feel like just people have to subscribe i can't control what people do you know all i can do is Say in every video to please subscribe and stuff, you know? But I don't know why you have to feel the need to say that. Like, that's kind of mean. Like, okay, you have a bigger following than me. Who cares? Um, ben Bolin. Put, I've had the iPhone 13 Pro Max for a little over a month now, and I love it. I heard your criticisms of certain features, and here's what I have to say. The gestures might take some time to get adjusted to, but they should become more natural over the course of several months. As for... 
opening the control center, swiping down from the right to check the battery percentage. J solution, so that could be adding battery widget to the home screen. As for the features, the ProMotion 120 HD displays major highlight, which is awesome. I can tell the difference between my previous phone, iPhone 12 Pro Max, and the one I'm on right now. Another feature I like is macro photography. I use it extremely often in the month or so that I've had this phone. There's also a progress video, but a con with that is that it is extremely large file size. So I am probably you two are probably not use that. I might try it in the near future though, but I'm skeptical skeptical of doing that because of the file size. I also like cinematic mode, despite the fact that it only goes up to 180p at 30 frames per second. I might consider using it more often. Finally, photogenic styles is a feature I've tested out, but I haven't used that feature often either. Um, thanks for telling me all this. I appreciate that. I haven't really messed around with the cameras too much. We're gonna obviously have the three different cameras. I haven't really messed around with it too much. Oh, I'll, I'll actually I've never even met, messed around with it at all. So, but thank you for that. I appreciate your um, support of my channel and commenting that. Thank you for letting me know all that. I appreciate it. Michael Moore. Hey, Kyle, I just watched this video of you reacting to Justin Ashley's video, and you admitted that you were jealous of Ashley in your reaction video. Like I told you before, Kelly, you need to move on with your life. Stop obsessing yourself with Jesse and find someone else. Like I told you before, Jesse and Ashley are in love and in a relationship together. You can still be a joyy fan like me, but leave Jesse alone. He has Ashley, so move on. I'm not trying to sound like an asshole, but you, Kelly, have to wake up and smell the roses of reality. The reality is Jesse and Ashley are in love and in relationship, and Kelly, you need to find someone else. And then there's a few, but this one says, I get what you're saying, but I can't control. You can't control who you fall in love with, and just can't flip a switch and turn it off. Trust me, I wish I could. Um, and I get you know Jesse and Ashley are in love. Um, you know, the thing is though, it's really hard to say because you don't we don't know him personally. We, we just know what we see through videos and social media, which yes, it looks like they're in love. But you have to remember, they're not gonna put, they're not gonna show all the bad stuff if they get into fights and stuff. They're only gonna online you know they're always going to seem like they're happy and all that you know i'm not trying to say they're not happy but you have to keep that in mind you just can't assume things you know um but i can't hear people use that as a reason oh because they're with someone like just because you're in a relationship that really does not mean anything people break up all the time that's life they can break up one day you never know you know and i would never do anything to intentionally break them up or whatever but if if jesse was to one day break up with ashley for me I just be with him because to me it's like if someone breaks up for, with their significant other for you and you don't date them it's like that was just what was the point of them breaking up it's like you cause someone to break up you cause pain for what but I'm not saying you personally if someone chooses to break up with a significant other for you it's not really so much on you but like don't make the breakup be for nothing that's my point and then Michael Moore put again, well, as of now, Ashley and Jesse are still together in a relationship. Plus, Jesse has feelings for Ashley, and Ashley has feelings for him. In fact, if I'm a mutual friend of me and my lady is doing the same thing you are doing to me, you are doing to me. And I had to tell her, look, you rejected me. How? How? I'm not actively trying to pursue him, though. I'm not messaging him. I'm not trying to do anything like that. So, I don't know how this is the same, but okay. Um, it's doing the same for me. You rejected me and I'm with someone else to move on and she eventually moved on with her and Kelly. You have to do the same. Jesse isn't going to wait for you. He has his own woman. Okay, I'm going with that. Why would he wait for me? If anything, I'm waiting for him. Um, yes, this woman and they are in love and in a relationship together. So the best thing for you, Kelly, is to do is just be a joggy fan like me and move on and support Jesse as a Jag fan, but not romantically. Please let Jesse be happy with Ashley because that is his woman and you're not. So continue to be a Juggy fan like me supporting Jesse, but at the same time, can I find someone else today? There are a lot of guys out there for you to date. And right now, Jesse is off the market like me because me and Jesse have our ladies. And I understand when you said that, please let Jesse and Ashley be happy. I don't know how I'm not letting them be happy again. 
like I said too, you can choose who you fall in love with. That's why a lot of people say love is a drug, because it's true. You can't control who you fall in love with, and you know, and you get hurt a lot when it comes to love, and it sucks. But I can't control me being in love with Jesse. Me and him have a connection that you you can't deny. You know, I get it. He's in the relationship, but again, that doesn't necessarily mean anything. You know. I think me and Jesse could be together because I feel like me and Ashley are kind of similar looking. Both have brown eyes, both have round faces and stuff. I don't know. Look, I love Jesse. Maybe one day, you know, you should never give up on love. That's the thing. No matter what, no matter what obstacle is in your way. Obviously, don't go out of your way to break up someone just cause, to break up a couple just because you want to be with one of the people in the relationship. I wouldn't do that. Don't be that. Don't try and pursue the person to cheat on their significant other with you just because you want to be with them. Don't do that, but don't give up at the same time. And then I put, how am I not letting them be happy? And I get, I need to move on, but you realize it's easier said than done. I would at least like to be friends with him one day. Then the last thing he put is, um, all I'm saying is just be friends with Jesse and that's it. You're absolutely right. You may meet Jesse someday, but going forward, just be friends with Jesse and find someone else today. And you would be golden because then Jesse and Ashley would be, Jesse will be with Ashley and then you will be with your boyfriend. Plus everyone is happy. Well, you never know. They could break up one day. You know, that's the thing. So, look, I get what you're trying to say that I should move on. Trust me, I wish I could. I wish I could put my feelings away. I wish I could flip a switch, but that's not how it works. You know? Anyways, um, Chris, Kelly, I saw that Brianna person spamming your channel. I just... A fair wording. She's been spamming my second channel too. I've reported her to YouTube. Great video, by the way. Thank you for letting me know. Um, I did, um, with all the comments reported, I spam and deleted them, but then she ended up commenting again. But she must have deleted them because they're not around anymore. Michael Moore. Hey, Kelly. I respect your grind. Keep it up. Juggies for life. Appreciate your support, man. I put thank you. I really appreciate your support. Um, and he put no problem anytime. Andrew Weber. We're getting close to the end, guys. Um, the books are way better than the movies. The movies leave out so much. I mean, that's how it always is when it comes... And he's referring to Harry Potter. That's how it always is when they make um, movies and or books in the movies. You know, it's really impossible to have every single detail in a movie or the movie would be like five hours long. You know, so that's the thing, too. But I feel like the movies are probably still good, you know. Yes, books are always better because they have more detail, but, you know... Anyways, Dylan Vincent, hey Kelly, there's this kid, his name is Isaiah, he's bullying me, and he said, you don't want to be my friend, is that true? Is that true, you don't want to be my friend, Kelly? Um, like I said, all my, I consider all my randomers my friends, and here's a tip for bullying, ignore them, don't let them get to you, don't give a reaction to it, because that's what bullies want, they want you to react, they want, you know, you to be upset, but if you just don't, you just ignore them, and don't let it bother you, then they'll get bored and leave you alone. So just keep that in mind. Um, he put, is that true? Dylan Vincent. Um, and I put no. And then he put, oh, we're still friends. Okay. Um, Glory, Glory Glenn had so much fun. She's referring to when we went to Ikea Friday in my vlog. Dylan Vincent. Hey, Kelly, do you have... Or is this the last comment? This is the last comment. He put, hey, Kelly, do you have so much fun to be there? Do you have so much fun or no? Just say yes. Say yes it's three times if you had fun much fun do you have much fun i mean if you watch the video you see i said i enjoyed it and stuff so yeah i did have fun i didn't mean to sound like a bitch if i did but just you know watch the video so it usually will give you answers you need i did have fun i did say i enjoyed it um hope you guys enjoyed this reading your comments video um please i encourage you to continue to comment i love reading you guys' comments and like i said a lot of time most of the time too i will always like them or heart them um and once in a great while, I may reply, depending on what the comment is. Um, but for the most part, I usually reply to them through my videos. So, I encourage you to watch them in the future. I encourage you to go back and watch my other reading comments videos because they're interesting. Um, but I love you, Random, so much. Please follow me on my socials. Follow Khan on Insta. Subscribe to Josh. Subscribe to Oysen Squad Juggy. Subscribe to Dan. Subscribe to Jacob. Subscribe to Caleb. Subscribe to Colin. Um, guys, please subscribe to me. Please like and please comment and I'll see your viewers in the next video. Peace.